A crowded bus, a struggling woman, and a young boy with a heart of gold. Sounds like the beginning of a heartwarming tale, right? Well, buckle up because this story is about to take you on a roller coaster ride of kindness, courage, and unexpected twists. What happens when a simple act of compassion leads to a chain of events that could change lives forever? Ready to find out? Every morning in the bustling city, young Arthur and his father Robert could be found at the same bus stop, patiently waiting the arrival of their ride. The air was crisp, carrying with it a sense of anticipation and possibility as the sun began its ascent into the sky. Robert, with a mix of concern and pride, would use this time to impart his final words of guidance to his son before their daily separation. It was a routine that they perfected over time, a ritual that spoke volumes of their bond and the love between them. Remember what I taught you, son, Robert would say. I won't be able to go with you today because I have a job interview. With a glimmer of independence shining in his eyes, Arthur would nod in understanding. I'm nine years old, Dad. I'm a grown-up now, he'd declare with a brave smile, though a hint of nervousness lingered beneath the surface. The bus would eventually arrive, its metallic frame rumbling into view like a giant beast ready to swallow up its passengers. With Robert's help, Arthur would board the vehicle, their farewell hug carrying the weight of unspoken reassurances and silent wishes for a good day ahead. As the bus pulled away from the stop, Arthur settled in his corner seat, finding solace in the routine of his daily commute. Through the window, he would gaze out at the city awakening around him, observing the diverse tapestry of its inhabitants. The streets came alive with the hustle and bustle of morning activity, each person with their own story to tell and destination to reach. Arthur watched in quiet fascination, his young mind absorbing the sights and sounds of the city as the bus trundled along its designated route. In the fleeting moments between home and school, Arthur felt a sense of connection to the world around him, a realization that he was but one small part of a larger tapestry. Little did he know during this ordinary journey that his life would intersect with the extraordinary, setting into motion a series of events that would change everything. She's struggling, you see, unable to scrounge up enough coins to pay for her bus fare. It's a common predicament for many, but on this particular day, it would lead to something extraordinary. As she stepped onto the bus, her distress was palpable, her voice trembling as she explained her situation to the bus driver. But instead of empathy or understanding, she was met with scorn and cruelty. The driver's harsh words cut through the air like a knife, his public humiliation of the woman echoing throughout the bus. But just when it seemed like no one would step in, enter Arthur, the young hero of our story, with heart bigger than his stature, he bravely stood up to the bully of a driver offering up his own lunch money to pay for the woman's fare. It was a selfless act born out of compassion and a sense of justice that bellied his tender years. And oh, the impact it had. The bus fell silent, each passenger stunned by the audacity of this boy. The driver, too, was left speechless, his tirade cut short by Arthur's act of kindness. And as for the woman, well, her tears and despair were replaced by tears of gratitude, her faith in humanity restored by the simple gesture of a stranger. You see, kindness has a way of rippling outwards, touching hearts, and changing lives in ways we can't predict. And on that bus, on that fateful morning, Arthur's act of courage would set into motion a chain of events that would remind us all of the power of compassion in a world that so often feels cold and indifferent. Arthur, with a rumbling stomach and a heart full of pride, gets off the bus after his heroic act. You'd think he'd be feeling pretty hungry, right? But instead, he's buzzing with excitement and a sense of accomplishment. Sure, he missed out on his lunch money, but what he gained in return was worth way more. As he walked to school, his mind was buzzing with thoughts of the incident. He couldn't shake off the image of the poor woman's tears, and he knew he did the right thing by standing up for her. When he got home, he couldn't wait to tell his dad all about it. Hey dad, you'll never guess what happened on the bus today. Arthur exclaimed, bursting with energy as he recounted the entire story to Robert. His dad listened intently, a face mix of pride and concern. You did the right thing, son, Robert said, his voice tinged with emotions. But I'm worried about you going hungry. Let's see what we can do to make sure you have enough to eat. And so, Robert set out to secure financial aid for Arthur's education 
He knew that his son deserved the best, and he wasn't going to let anything stand in the way of his dreams. It wasn't easy, but with a little persistence and a lot of determination, he managed to find a solution that would ensure Arthur could continue his education without any worries. But just when things seemed to be falling into place, something unexpected happened. The next morning as Arthur was getting ready for school, a sleek Mercedes pulled up outside their house. You can imagine surprise and curiosity and that filled the air as Arthur and Robert stepped outside to see who it was. And there she was, Maggie, the woman from the bus, stepping out of the car like a real-life fairy godmother. The sight of her luxury car parked outside the school generated whispers and excitement among the students, but Arthur and Robert were too stunned to even speak. Little did they know Maggie's arrival was about to change their lives in ways they could have never imagined. But that's a story for another time. For now, let's just say that sometimes surprises can lead to the most extraordinary adventures. Let's talk about destiny, shall we? Because sometimes it has a funny way of sneaking up on us when we least expect it. Take Maggie, for example, the woman from the bus with her elegant clothes and luxurious car. You'd never expect she was the same person Arthur had helped just the day before. But there she was, pulling outside Arthur's school in that fancy Mercedes of hers, like something straight out of a fairy tale. And let me tell you, the sight of her stepping out of that car turned more than a few heads. So you know how sometimes when people have a lot of money and fancy stuff, they act all snooty and stuff. Well, that's not Maggie. Nope, not at all. Even though she's got all the wealth and glamour, she's feeling super grateful to this kid, Arthur. He showed her some kindness when she really needed it and she's not forgetting that anytime soon. So, picture this, Maggie walking up to Arthur, her voice all sincere and thank you. Arthur, she says, you're a real hero. Seriously, I can't even begin to thank you for what you did on the bus yesterday. And then boom, she drops a big old bombshell on him. She wants to help him out, like really help him out. She wants to pay for his education so he can have all the chances in the world to do well in life. Isn't that something? It's like Maggie's turning her gratitude into action, making sure Arthur's got every opportunity to succeed. And you can bet Arthur's jaw probably hit the floor when he heard that offer. But hey, that's what happens when kindness meets generosity, right? It's a beautiful thing. Robert's sitting there, probably with his jaw hanging open, trying to process what Maggie just said. I mean, who wouldn't be shocked? Someone offering to pay for your kid's education out of the blue? That's like hitting the jackpot on a random Tuesday. At first, Robert's probably thinking, nah, this can't be real. I mean, that's a natural reaction. But then, as Maggie starts explaining herself, her genuine desire to help Arthur, something clicks in Robert's brain. He starts to see that maybe, just maybe, this isn't some crazy dream. Maybe it's a chance to give his son a shot at a future he never thought possible. So there's Robert, feeling a mix of emotions swirling around inside of him. Gratitude for sure, I mean, who wouldn't be grateful for such an incredible offer? But also a bit of humility. It's not easy accepting help, especially when it's this big. But deep down, Robert knows this is a game changer. It's a chance to turn their lives upside down in the best way possible. And in the end, after all the back and forth in his head, Robert nods. He accepts Maggie's offer, knowing full well that this is a turning point. A moment that'll shape their future in ways they couldn't even begin to imagine. Crazy how one act of kindness can ripple out to change everything, huh? But hey, that's the beauty of life sometimes. Little did they know this was just the beginning of a journey that would lead them down a path filled with love, laughter, and unexpected twists of fate. Remember Maggie, the woman from the bus with the fancy car and the heart of gold? Well, it turns out her life story is even more jaw-dropping than you could imagine. See, it all started with a kidnapping attempt. Yeah, you heard that right. Maggie was just minding her own business when some bad guys tried to snatch her up and hold her for ransom. But here's the thing, Maggie wasn't going to go down without a fight. With quick thinking and a whole lot of bravery, she managed to escape from her captors. Running for her life through the city streets until she was finally free. So even though Maggie managed to get away from danger, she wasn't out of the woods just yet. Nope, she found herself facing a whole new bunch of problems. Despite being from a well-off family, Maggie was stuck in a tight spot. She had zilch money, no phone to call for help, and zero ways to get back home. Talk about being in a pickle. 
But hey, here comes the plot twist. Maggie hops onto this bus, feeling all lost and helpless. And who does she bump into? None other than Arthur, our unexpected hero. I'm talking about a real knight in shining armor situation. Arthur's just chilling on the bus when he sees Maggie in her predicament. And you know what he does? He steps up. Big time. Now let me paint you a picture of Arthur's reaction when he hears about what Maggie's been through. It's like his mind is blown. Like he just won the lottery or something. Here he is thinking he's just being a decent human and bam. Turns out his small act of kindness made a huge difference in Maggie's world. It's almost like something straight out of a superhero flick, with Arthur playing the hero and Maggie the damsel in distress. Isn't it wild how life throws these curveballs at us? One minute you're feeling lost and alone, and the next someone like Arthur comes along and changes everything. It's moments like these that makes you believe in the power of kindness, don't you think? But here's where things get interesting. As Maggie and Robert got to know each other better, they realized that they had more in common than they could have ever imagined. Despite their being different backgrounds, they shared a bond forged by adversity and shared a commitment to make the world a better place. And so a genuine friendship was born, one that would see Maggie become a regular fixture in Arthur and Robert's lives. She wasn't just a benefactor, she was a family member, a source of love, support, and laughter in their time of need. Together they faced the ups and downs of life with courage and resilience, knowing that as long as they had each other, they could overcome anything. As they looked back on the journey that had brought them together, they couldn't help but marvel at the power of kindness and compassion to change lives in ways they never thought possible. Here's a little reflection on the power of kindness and compassion. Because let me tell you, this story is chock full of life lessons that will have you thinking long after you've put down the tissues. First off, let's talk about the big ones. Kindness. I'm talking about those small acts of compassion that have the power to create profound change in the world. Just look at Arthur, the young hero of our story, whose simple act of paying for a stranger's bus fare set off a chain of events that changed lives forever. But it's not just about the big gestures, it's about the little things we do every day to show kindness and compassion to those around us. Whether it's a smile, a kind word, or a helping hand, each act of kindness has the power to make someone's day just a little brighter. And let's not forget about fate, people, because as the story proves, sometimes life has a way of throwing us unexpected curveballs that lead us down paths we never could have imagined. Who would have thought that a chance encounter on a bus would lead to the formation of a loving family unit? It just goes to show that we're all connected in ways we may not even realize. So what's the takeaway here? It's simple, really embrace kindness in your own life. Whether it's lending a hand to a stranger in need or reaching out to a friend who's going through a tough time, each act of kindness has the power to make a difference. So go ahead, spread a little love and compassion wherever you go. You never know whose life you might change in the process. And who knows, you might just find yourself on the receiving end of a little kindness when you least expect it. From the moment Arthur decided to cover a stranger's bus fare to the beautiful bond that formed between him, Maggie, and Robert. This tale showcases just how amazing kindness can be. Seriously, it's like a masterclass in empathy and compassion. Think about it. Arthur starts off by doing something so simple, yet so meaningful. He pays for someone's bus ticket without expecting anything in return. And you know what? That one small act sets off a chain reaction that changes lives. Fast forward a bit, and we've got this incredible family unit with Maggie and Robert. It's like they were meant to find each other, brought together by Arthur's initial act of generosity. It's heartwarming, really. But here's the thing. This story isn't just about Arthur, Maggie, or Robert. It's a reminder to us all that even the tiniest acts of kindness can have a massive impact. I'm talking about holding the door open for someone, giving a stranger a smile, or even just listening when someone needs to talk. It all matters. So, as we say goodbye to our friends Arthur, Maggie, 
And Robert, I want to throw out a little challenge to all you lovely listeners. Take a minute to seek out more stories like this one. Trust me, there's nothing quite like a heartwarming tale to lift your spirits and remind you that there is still goodness left in the world. Whether it's through books, movies, or real life experiences, there's no shortage of tales that celebrate the beauty of human connection and the triumph of the human spirit. And hey, if you enjoyed this story as much as I have, why not subscribe to our channel or even the website? That way you'll never miss out on the latest heartwarming content that's sure to warm your soul and put a smile on your face. So go ahead everyone, spread a little kindness, embrace the power of empathy, and remember that no matter how small, your actions have the potential to change the world. Until next time, keep shining bright and spreading love wherever you go.